Michigan. Weighing in at 236 pounds, Shane McMahon. And his opponent, from Grenoble in the French Alps, weighing in at 476 pounds, he is the WWE Hardcore Champion, the eighth wonder of the world, Andre the Giant. After weeks of talking about it, we are finally here to put an end to the dispute of who is better. There's no telling what these competitors will do in Extreme Rules, but I can guarantee we're about to find out. Look at these two giving it their all. There's absolutely no quit in them tonight. Well, let's quickly get your opinion on Andre the Giant. Andre was undefeated for more than 15 years. Global attraction and the first ever inductee into the WWE Hall of Fame. How's that for a resume? Well, whether Shane McMahon's diving off the highest fixed point in an arena onto an opponent or announcing that he's leading an alliance, the boy wonders responsible for some of the most shocking moments in sports entertainment. Look at the attack here. Oh, man. Talk about a direct hit. And he escapes with a kick out. Oh, my gosh. If Andre the Giant kicked out of that, then what else can you hit him with? A freight train? He's absolutely relentless here. Man, that one rocked him. Just trying to goad his opponent into making a mistake here. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Keep the action inside the ring. That's where you're going to win this thing. Jerry, we all know Shane McMahon can be flamboyant, cocky, impulsive, and a slew of other adjectives. But one thing he most certainly is above all else, that's fearless. Of course Shane is all those things, but you know what? So is every other successful media mogul. You don't reach such heights by having the word welcome ripped across your chest. Shane's not a doormat. Getting some air here. I need some too after sitting next to you. I mean, the shoulders are down. One, two. And he kicks out. And he lives to fight again. There's no keeping this guy down tonight. Andre the Giant takes the upper hand here. Great match here, but if you missed any of the matches from this week, go to WWE.com to catch up on all the action. I go to WWE. Oh, incredible move by Shane McMahon. When you're talking about the best of all time, I mean the absolute elite in this industry, Andre the Giant must be included in that conversation. Not only is he a sports entertainment icon, but his name resonates in all four. Here he goes for the win. Let's do this. One, two. And he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. How did that not keep the Giant down? If that won't work, I don't think anything will. These superstars looking for a victory, looking to build momentum. You're right about that. Oh, wow. Ow! Ooh. There's a point where all of your training goes right out the window and you rely on instinct. After getting beaten twice with a weapon, you can bet this is one of those times. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I can't blame him. Keep it in the ring. Watch out! Sometimes 
when you go high risk, you crash and burn. And sometimes you knock it out of the park. And that was a perfect example of hitting it big. Oh, man, that's got to hurt. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. Nothing good is going to happen out here on the floor. Uh-oh. Andre the Giant seeks out a big move here. He's in full-on attack mode now. What an insane move by Andre the Giant. Look at to catch him off guard. Quick round Two, count. Three. Defending the title decisively. Oh, they threw everything they had at each other in this match. You want to talk about crowd play? And here's some highlights from the matchup. Let's go to the highlights here. Here's your winner and still the hardcore champion, the eighth wonder of the world, Andre the Giant. The shoulders are down for three, and this one's in the books. That's a statement win, Michael. That's a win that says, hey, everybody, look at me. And I'll tell you, the roof nearly blew off this place in Rosemont when the bell finally rang to end this one.